perfect. <laughs> All right, let's see. I'm curious to see who Vivi is going to be starting with. And it looks like it is going to be the hero. Dumpling King, though, starting things off with the Bowser, not uh, not wanting to chance the Ganon, unfortunately. But Bowser, still pretty big, still pretty funny. He should chance the Ganon. He should. Go! <laughs> <laughs> Oh, helper. <laughs> okay, Vivi, for some reason, sitting very tall in their chair. Oh, hello. That, that's not going to kill. I, no, I think he did not. it too early. He did too early. Oh, my God. Uh, a masterful uh, tactic there. Masterful gambit from Vivi there with the clank. But Dumpling King is able to bring us to even percent actually bringing the percentage into his favor as he continues this pressure but getting caught from mashing out of disadvantage the down air yeah now what yeah he's a christmas tree bb f smash jump scare coming in dumpling king you know bowser you know faster than you would think but not you know fast enough to prevent VV from going to the other side of the stage and getting the buffs, but Dumpling King, no buffs needed. The anti-air up tilt, taking VV's first stock and putting Dumpling also, King in no lead. I do just want to say this. Let's keep count of every VV respawn that has uh, Kaboom in the opening menu because that's one. I'll be, I'll be looking out for that. Ooh, another air dodge. Uh, BB has just been all over Dumpling King's disadvantage options right there, finding the double jump. Yo, the Bowser jet. Oh my Woo! god! He's dead! He died! Accelerado makes you lighter. For those of you who didn't know. Yeah, just that just that little bit. BB now a you know, pretty uh, significant Dang. stock deficit. Oh, there was no but kaboom in his res in their respawn menu. Nope. Did get the double bang. All right, psych up back here. Not going to be taking it just yet. No rage on deck. And, it, you know, Bowser, big, funny, heavy. He's so big. Ooh, this pressure coming in with the jabs. F-Till does catch the jump out of shield, though. BB looking to not get, you know, too much extra credit. <laughs> BB's looking for the up-tilt. Yeah. Leggy. <laughs> Not the stanky leg. I stick my leggy out real far. What was that movement? It looked like maybe was guaranteed to cross up right there, but no, just right back in uh, same side, getting the, uh, the grab for their troubles. Ah! Frizz online, but that's an expensive spell. Maybe. All right, with the up tilt, does start to get the cash back in. The oh, bank. that's a problem. Kaboom. Okay. Woo! Don't Ledge mechanics. Ledge mechanics, my beloved. Sizzle? No, BB instead of opting for the grab. <laughs> Gotta be careful. He can't shield. Yeah, yeah what? do not shield. Okay, VV standing up before the kill is confirmed. Well, but yeah. Oof, psych up. Yeah, but it looked... Look. Look, 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 look. <laughs> said that in time I know. music. He started to slow down at the end as VV yeah. was standing up. Anyway, a great showing from Dumpling King for that game one. Absolutely. I do declare. Take, taking the lead multiple times right there. So definitely not out of the realm of possibility for Dumpling King as we move on into game two. Start battle. Hero. Bowser. Yep, sticking with the Bowser. No gains to be found here, unfortunately. So let's see as we move on into game two, moving into small battlefield. Definitely a better stage for Bowser as opposed to uh, PS2. We saw VV getting a lot of space in game one, getting that space to find the you know all the buffs underneath the PS2 platforms. Small battlefield, a little bit smaller. Dumpling King's gonna have an opportunity to get a little bit more in their face, but right now. VB just continuing to play that that same game plan, and Dumplinking has not been able to find that same pressure. Ooh, just kind of a quick jab check from VB. How you feeling in your shield right now, bud? Ooh, a, a whoosh. Putting Dumplinking back on the stage. That huge forward air, almost taking things. As does the swoosh. 
Wow, the Whirling Fortress just goes right through Kaswoosh. That is new information to me. All right, Psych Up online right now for VV, which means pretty much anything will kill. Ooh, Dumpling King with the meaty up tilt, not getting caught by any of VV's uh, Psych Up options. And instead, Dumpling King, once again with the lead, doesn't last long. The leads against VV simply do not last very long for Dumpling King, unfortunately. That's big damage, though. Clean 38 on the board. Vivi just sticking the sword right through the platform. Said, you're looking, you're looking to trap me on a platform? No, you're trapped with you're trapped in here with me. Ooh, some clean B reverse movement from VV. Getting the tomahawk grab out of it. Boom, a little bit too close. ZD just F smashing out of disadvantage. Just get out of here. Give me some space. Social distance, please. Alright, boom. Unfortunate. VV, I I'm not entirely sure what happened there. I don't know if VV just didn't have the mana for uh for the up special. But Dumplinking once again with the stock lead. Gonna see if he's able to make anything of it. Psych up throw, not taking it just yet. No rage and uh, you know, Bowser still heavy. Ooh, not finding it. the sweet spot of the flame breath. Dumplinking not able to find much extra credit. This could be it. All right, going for the side B. Finally starting to find some extra credit. Zap coming in and bounce, which means Flame Breath is offline. Dumpling King's been looking for that. It's such a fantastic move at these low percentages. All right, but BB, er, Dumpling King did find some extra credit finally, but not a whole lot. 60% now. Dumpling King looking for a ledge trap option, but Zap, such a great move for finding some space at the ledge. That's a lot of mana off the table right now for Vivi, though. Only 28. It's gonna you're going to have to spend some of it right now on this recovery as the Flame Breath forces Vivi to use this, the whoosh over and over again and the uh, up tilt from Dumpling King. But he has to 1-1. One, one. Yeah, this was so smart from Dumpling King to hold that Flame Breath and just drain the mana. Vivi only had one more whoosh in stock right there. They were able to make it back. That was silly. Whirling Fortress just going right through Kaswoosh. That's extremely silly. <gasps> Aww. Dumpling King hovered over Ganon for like a second, but thought better of it. Decided, you know, I'm gonna stick with what Stick with what won me a game, and we're going to Hollow Bastion as Phoebe's kind of pick. I'm actually, I'm curious what the thought process was here. I'm, you know, I would think that this would be much more a Bowser stage, just for, you know, how good Bowser is at scrapping, of course, having that up the out of shield, and then if Phoebe's not able to find the stage control, they're going to be hurting for buffs. That being said, though, Vivi is the one with the stage control, and stage control just being so exacerbated on these monoplat stages, they're finding, like, all sorts of buffs. But yeah, like I was saying, that quick scrapping potential of Bowser in the up special to for Dumpling King to find that space. All right, using the psych up on an F throw, setting up in another ledge trapping situation. That being said, though, stage control. What is stage control when VV has Accelerado? They're they're zooming around all over the stage. You, the, the whole stage is theirs. Like, yeah, okay, you can have your little spot underneath the platform. I get everywhere else. Accelerado once again on stage, and we're starting to see that double-edged sword we thought would be in Dumpling King's favor, but instead it is Vivi who has the stage control, has the buffs. All right, gonna have to use a Kasmoosh right there to get back onto stage, but Dumpling King giving up that stage control, instead looking for an edge guard of his own, and he gives up that space. That's okay. You know what? He's giving up the space, but he's not giving up this set. Ooh. 
Not oh, even that stock as that he makes it back. Didn't even look like a tech. That was such a weird anime. I've never seen that before. We like those weirdo animations. We learn something new every time we commentate this game. It really is. All right, look at this. What are we going to see? Right, Zoom coming in. Oh! Dumplinging had the space, no! but didn't believe. Okay, what are we going to see here? 169, Vivi at 109. Okay, Dumpling King just needs one good there decision. Go. And there it is. This is still an even game. 169, Bowser Rage? Crazy. Though, uh, watch your shield there. Yeah, Psych Up was online, but uh, Vivi using it on the Zapple back right back in Vivi's hands. And though. there we go. A good forward air taking that one. And Dumpling King bringing out the spicy one, being like, you're not going to be able to handle this. Uh oh. But if Bounce comes back, that Fire Breath ain't going to do anything. Yeah, Dumpling King with very few resources here at the ledge. No platforms to help him out. Ooh. And he is just stuck in the Hero Blender right now with all of these different spells. Dumpling King needs to slow this down, Vivi, with so much pressure. But you're a grappler. You just need to wait it out. Yeah, Dumpling King looking for some grabs oh. right now. But instead, Vivi finding a grab of their own. This could be Dumpling King's chance to play the game right now as Vivi does give up that stage control. No, a little too eager there to make something happen. Yeah, 191 okay. right now. It is Ooh. not looking good for Dumpling King fans. And the okay, here we go, here we go. Almost taken. No! Excellent. With yep. a nice little a nice little early pop-off there, just being like, oh, again, yep. no. GG's. Honestly, still a great set, though. 1-1. One, one. Taking the game off of Vivi is no easy yeah. feat. Yeah, definitely looked doable after that game, too. Dumpling King really started to bring things back into his favor. And even game one wasn't so bad. Dumpling King was the first one to take stocks a lot of the time, but it's just Vivi would fire right back, and Vivi was the one to take the last stock. Yeah. But that's all right. You know what? It's in these moments where if you're playing a grappler, you you kind of know what's happening, right? You got to play slowly. You have to play methodically. Everything that's a negative nine matchup is always a plus ten once you get that grab. Yeah. And but but you know if you can't do it, you can't do it. Yeah. And that's what the next set is for. They're still in losers. Top twenty-four.